Brubaker. Thought he uh, really did a good job uh, in that last start, right? Good. I, I thought he really did a good job. Kept his uh, pitch count down too. Reds come in with a record of seven and 24. They've won four of six. Pirates 13 and 17. And here's a fly ball. Reynolds. See what I mean, Greg? Yeah, actually, it's exactly what yeah. you meant. Two ground balls and a fly ball. Reds fire Connor Overton, who was darn good in game one of Saturday's twin build against the Pirates. By Yoshi Sutsugo could give the Pirates a pair of runs. Hayes is nearly halfway to the plate. Grounded a first and Colin Moran, the former Pirate, who received a video tribute before the game got underway, underhand shovel in the scoreless opening inning for Connor Overton. You want to talk about hitters that are red hot right now. Stevenson hitting 322, three homers, 17 RBIs. He had a, another monster game yesterday afternoon, going three for five, scored a couple of times. He ended up driving home four. Shoots that one up the middle center field base hit windmill is on from J.R. House at third Reynolds from medium center fires to the plate cut off Moustakas scores comeback contact for Tyler Stevenson and he gives the Reds a one nothing lead. You pitch him in he takes you right back up the middle. You pitch him away he takes you out. And boy is he able to get that bat around and just keep his head right on the baseball. Just a beautiful swing with two men aboard and two out that will put them in motion here. Here it is. Swing a ground ball hit to third Hayes has it Cooley tosses across for the out that ends the inning. Reds get the game's first run on two hits strand two through an inning and a half one nothing Cincinnati. Now Michael Perez he's hit two home runs in his three games with the Pirates left handed batter. And he's ripped to right field. Down for a base hit. Sawitzki shoots through second. The ball lost briefly by Naquin. Stop sign to third. Throw to second. Farmer drops the tag on the batter runner, Michael Perez, who took a big gamble and had no shot dead to rights. A good five strides before second base. That's just not knowing the arm of your opponent. I mean, we've seen it because we get to see it every day with Tyler Naquin. He did bobble the ball. Yes, the ball got by him. Boy, you talk about coming back up with a laser shot into second base. I mean this this throw after the bobble there was so far ahead of Michael Perez he basically had to stop and think about changing directions going back where he came from. Well the Reds will take that because now a fly ball is the inning instead of a run. Full count three balls two strikes slider missed away Stevenson responsible for the Reds lone run payoff rock to left field Ben Gamble a deep retreat he won't get there God. Annihilated by Tyler Stevenson as he lines a homer and the Reds have a two nothing lead both runs knocked in by catcher QB one. Well, he got Stevenson to chase that breaking ball early in the count. Then Tyler laid off of it for a couple of pitches and instead of trying to start it on the plate and get it off he leaves it on the plate right down Broadway. You're not getting that one back. He singled home Moustakis in the second inning, and now he drives himself in with a home run here in the fourth. And he remains absolutely white hot. It's now two to nothing. And two Reds retired in the fifth. Tommy Pham is the batter. The pitch. And Pham shoots one on the ground, right side, sliding stop. Van Meter from his knees throws. Got him. Fine play by the former Red, Josh Van Meter, ranging far to his left to make the play to take it away from Tommy Pham. A gentleman making his major league debut and a Cincinnati product. How about that? Cam Aldred, 2015 graduate of Country Day School in Cincy, a 204 earn run average combined last year and this season, and a 193 opponent's. Batting average That's against excellent numbers. Stevenson has singled in a run and homer. So both ribbies and a good test now for Cam Aldred, the 25 year old. Strike three. How about that? For a strikeout in the big leagues for Cam Aldred. Down and in. Beautiful spot. Another 0 2. And a bouncing ball to Sutsugo. A short hop. Nice easy inning. Cam Aldred in his big league debut, a 1 2 3 inning. Brian Reynolds a walk. He's bounced into a double play. Oh, he got him. Great pick off Moran. Flicks it over. Drury gets the tag on as the helmet flies free. Brilliant pick off. Well, we saw a couple of awfully good moves by Overton earlier with Hayes at first base. And Gamble, I think he was going on first move. He just 
got caught dead to rights. I mean, there's no going back at that point. Can he go six for the first time in the big leagues and have himself in line for the win? 2-2, two -two, lifted to left, right at Tommy Pham. He's there. He'll make the catch. Side retired. Overton, the first red starter this year to put six complete innings in the book. Pop the champagne. <laughs> That's the longest start by a Reds hurler this year. Tyler Stevenson has had himself a night already. Two for three. He singled home Moustakis in the second inning and then homered in the fourth. He's responsible for both. Another one over Hayes. Bam turns and holds Tyler Stevenson with a three hit night. Yeah, you lay that breaking ball over the plate to Stevenson and he just risked it. You can see the body kind of stay back a little bit and then just take those hands right through the ball. You didn't try to overswing, just barrel to baseball on the breaking ball. That's how still this head is. Well, the Reds look for padding. Colin Moran, another payoff. Looped into left center, down base hit. Fam giving the green light at third. He whips around, chugs home, fired at third. Stevenson on the way, head first plunge. He's in safely. Moran, a long AB, connects on an RBI single and salts the Reds' lead. It's three to nothing. Went out and got that fastball. It was off the plate, away. And he just served it right through that left side of the infield. Boy, like he caught it off the end of the bat. Tyler Naquin is singled, stolen a bag on a one for three nine. Something that can be competitive in a good way. Oh, Naquin hits a fly ball. Fairly deep right. That's going to clang off the wall. Stevenson breaks from third, but off was Moran, who goes first to third. And Tyler Naquin is at second base standing with an RBI double. Four nothing Reds. And that is not an easy ball to judge whether you're a base runner whether you're up here or whether you're actually trying to catch the ball in right field. And momentarily it looked like Sawinski was going to be able to make the catch and you see him start to back up and as soon as he started to back up everybody started taking off. And Art Warren is in with the Reds up four. No two. Farmer feeds Drury. In time, double play. And the Cincinnati Reds take the series opener. They have won four of five, five of seven. And the Reds snap a 13-game road losing streak and halt what had been their longest series of road woes since 1933.